Hey you guys, what's up? It's Hannah and welcome or welcome back to my channel. I did not know that one human needed this many things, but oh my gosh, there are so many things. As you can tell by the title of today's video, we are going to be doing a haul of literally everything that I've gotten for my freshman dorm because I'm going to be a freshman in college. I think literally aside from a mattress pad, a mirror I need for my desk, and some command strips, this is literally everything I need, or at least I hope it is because this is so much stuff. So the light is kind of funky because the sun is starting to set but I just got back from like my last shopping trip for my dorm and I really want to bring all this stuff out of my room and into the garage. So we're just gonna get started. There is no rhyme or reason to what I'm gonna show you guys because I just want to get going so we're just gonna grab stuff and go for it. Ooh, the first thing I have is a little trash can from Target. I think she's a good size because it's not a mini trash can but it's also not gigantic. It's also a locking trash can which I don't know why I would need my trash can to lock, but the lid does lock and it has a little like pedal so you can push it up to open it. Next up is also from Target. Also, I'm going to try to have everything I can linked in the description, but if I can't, I will just be telling you guys where everything's from as well. Next up, we have a drying mat. I do have a couple dishes, but I feel like I'll dry those as I use them. This is more to put like my shower caddy on to dry when I get out of the shower so my floor doesn't get all wet and gross. Right, next up, we're just going to do a whole little Daiso haul because I did go to Daiso. So this bag itself is actually like, a collapsible tote, so I'm going to like stick it in my bag and I'm probably going to use it when I need to go like shopping or to the store or whatever but the first thing I got was my own little water bottle cleaner because hygiene very self-explanatory I feel like a lot of the things that you don't realize you need when you move out are things you're so used to just your parents having for you like a trash can or a blow dryer like dish soap just random stuff like that and then going off the cleaning topic again we have some microfiber like cleaning cloths just to dust surfaces off and then this is the little bag that this bag folds into. And then also for shopping, I have little produce bags. I obviously won't be doing too much grocery shopping, but for whatever I do need, I have two little produce bags just in case. I have a little tab that sticks to the side of your desk to organize your cords because there's not that many outlets in a dorm, so I will have like my adapter on one outlet, so I feel like that'll be really helpful. All right, and then I have, these are so cute guys, look at these. I'm gonna open these up so I can show them to you. I got myself a couple of um, like cutlery sets. So first I just have a plain pair of chopsticks and it comes with its own little case. I have a fork and a spoon set that again comes in the case and I feel like this is just gonna keep it so much cleaner when I wash them. The third little set has um, chopsticks, a spoon, and a fork. I honestly probably only needed the one, but I wanted to have just like two of everything just in case. So those are all my little utensils. Finally from Daiso, I bought myself a mini stapler and some extra staples. Next up, this is from Target, and this is a super big surge protector. So it has... It has seven outlets and then also two USB ports because like I said, you don't get that much storage space in a dorm. She just looks like this. It's really big and this is going to come in really, really handy, I feel like. Next up is going to be a bunch of random stuff from Target because I also went to Target today. I have dishes. I want the reusable route. I feel like there's a lot of discourse when I was researching what to get on whether I should get reusable dishes or disposable dishes, but I decided to go with reusable. These were literally 50 cents a piece from Target. I got two plates and two bowls. I probably only needed one of each if we're being so honest, but I have two just in case. And then I got a singular plastic cup because I feel like I'll be drinking out of my water bottles and stuff most of the time. This is school related, not dorm related, but one of my classes did say that we needed a notebook and could not take digital notes, so I got two notebooks just in case. This actually is not from Target. These are little tacks from Ikea for a bulletin board that you guys will see in a minute. Continuing on to the Target haul, I got myself a little scrub mommy to do dishes with. And I have this cute little lamp just to put on my desk because dorm lighting is not it. And she's cute and she's small, so it won't take up too much space. Alright, and then the rest of this bag is very boring stuff, but also stuff that was still a necessity. So I got some hair wraps because I use these now, and I feel like it'll be really helpful to have more, especially going back and forth from my dorm to my room when I'm taking a shower. And I have a couple of things on the medicine side. So I have Benadryl because I have some food allergies, and then I have, like, PMS relief. I also have Neosporin, and I got Bluey Band-Aids because what other Band-Aids would you get? All the other medicine and stuff I feel like I would need for college, I basically have at home already, so I'll just be 
you're bringing those with me but make sure you guys stock up on medicine for everyone else watching this video going into college because it's so easy to get sick like it's such a germ fest so please stock up on emergency and all that stuff for more cleaning stuff i have some tied to go pens we have bounce dryer sheets for when i do my laundry and then my dish soap for when i do my dishes another boring college necessity is i have laundry detergent and fabric softener i chose to go for the smaller bottles just for convenience's sake because i'm going to be carrying these back and forth so i thought smaller bottles would be easier okay these are all from ikea this is the little cork board that i was talking about i'm gonna hang this up right on top of my desk and i'm gonna fill it with a bunch of pictures of my friends and family and stuff from home and then these I'm not gonna open them all the way I don't think but these are just stackable shoe racks from Ikea and I got two of them so I'm gonna stack them and put them on my closet floor just so that I have somewhere to store my shoes and then this is another thing I wouldn't think to buy for myself just because I'm so used to sharing with my mom but I did not have my own like hair tools and stuff so I went to Marshall's and I got myself a blow dryer and a flat iron I have my own curling iron already but I got a hot tools blow dryer with the diffuser on it because wavy hair and she looks like this. I've been using her. Love her. She's great. And then I also got myself my own flat iron because obviously the other flat iron is going to be up here with my mom and that would not be helpful to me. I'm not going to pull this down. I'll just zoom in on editing Hannah because you zoom in on it. But this is a three tier cart. This is from Target. It's like the same as the Ikea one but it's just slightly bigger and it had the handles on top which I just liked a little bit more. But I'm not going to build that until I go down to my dorm just because for transportation purposes I feel like that's easier. Behind the shoe organizers I have this three tier drawer from Target. Depending on if I loft my bed or not this will either go under my bed or in my closet. But whether I store clothes or like cleaning supplies and stuff in here. It's just storage is always a necessity. Also from Target, I have this foldable drying rack for clothes that can't be dried or just if the dryer is not doing a good job. I can open it up in my dorm, let my clothes dry, and then it collapses nice and easy when I'm not using it anymore. Moving on to the Amazon boxes. Starting with this one, the first thing I have in here is this little manicure set. This is from Marshalls, I think, and it just has like tweezers, nail clippers, stuff like that because that is also something that I'm going to need. I need to be able to do my brows and my nails at college. And then this is from Five Below and it's just this little acrylic calendar. I have a calendar in my room at home and I use it religiously. I am the most type A person you will ever meet in your entire life. So this was an absolute necessity and I also think it's just really, really cute. This is from Amazon and it's just this little fan but I think this fan is like the coolest thing in the world because you can prop it and just have it nice and little and just blowing on your desk or something while you do homework or you can expand it like super far up and then have it standing and just like blowing on you which I think is super cool and it has a bunch of like different settings so you can set how long you want the fan to blow for but then also like how hard you want it blowing next up this these are from daiso as well i will have a fridge and a freezer in my dorm that i'm going to be sharing with my roommate and i like cold water so i got myself from daiso these little ice cube trays this one is like a regular water bottle tray and then this one is like the sphere ice just because it's fun this again because dorm lighting is yucky i got myself some string led lights and this is just gonna go on the wall that goes like all the way across my bed and then I'm, the next thing i have is more of a de like functional decor slash storage piece and that is a jewelry organizer from amazon i feel like a lot of people have this but i like i wear a lot of jewelry and i like to be able to display it and my desk has shelves on it so Again, more vertical storage space because there's not a lot of storage in dorms. The final thing in this box, I actually did not buy. My friend was doing a raffle at his grad party and I won a bunch of like little Tupperware at the grad party and I didn't have to pay for it. So thank you, Jared, for having a grad party. Also, packing for college is literally just the world's most expensive game of Tetris. Like trying to get all this stuff to fit. These are all open right now and they have stuff in them because I've been using them to store stuff in my room but I did buy them for college let me stack them all up and I'll show you guys but I have these four stackable bins these are from Temu and I plan to use these to store like skincare and makeup and that kind of stuff on my desk moving on to this Amazon box so the first thing I have in here is this little mini trash can because I'm going to use this as kind of a bedside table slash bookshelf so this mini trash can is gonna go on there 
for like late night snacks are like mostly because I have the really bad habit of not taking my contacts out until two seconds before I go to sleep and then I'll kind of just like fling them across my room and then pick them up in the morning because I'm tired and I'm lazy which I don't think my roommate would appreciate so we have a little trash can to solve that problem and then I have this backpack laundry bag thing one because you need a laundry basket but this will also just make it easier to take my laundry to and from my door and then we have a Brita filter so I can have nice clean filtered water. I'm a big matcha and coffee girly and I do love ramen so I will be the stereotypical college freshman eating ramen in my dorm. And to do that you need hot water so I have this little water kettle, I think it's from Walmart? I have no idea. This is going to be my shower caddy. This is from the Target Dollar Spot actually. I think it's really cute. It has some like little dividers that come inside it. In here we have the cord to charge my fan. And then I have this little like toothbrush toothpaste holder from Temu. And we have a silicone heating pad for when I'm doing my hair, if I'm using my curler or my straightener. That way I just don't burn like the desk surface. Because I definitely have put little burn marks on my desk before, I'm not gonna lie. So this will help prevent that. And it was from the Target Dollar Spot. And then from Amazon, we have these mesh laundry bags, like socks and that kind of stuff, so that the dryer and the washer don't eat them. And then I'm just left like sockless. And the last thing that I have in here is this 8-pack of washcloths. These are from Target. Washcloths are very self-explanatory. I need to wash my face. The last thing that I have in here is this 4-pack of bath towels. These are from Amazon, and they're gray, so they match my towels. I feel like a lot of things in this haul are gray, like, like essential stuff. That wasn't intentional. Guys, we are on the last bin. Right. If I'm not mistaken, I think everything in this bin like just so happens to be bedding. Uh, so the first thing I have are bed sheet suspenders, bed sheet fasteners, whatever you want to call them, and you use these to clip your sheets under your bed so that when you're jumping on and off your bed, uh, like your sheets and stuff just aren't sliding around. And then I have two sets of sheets because everyone said that you should have two sets of like bed sheets. So these are from Target. I have a plain white pair and then also this really cute like little floral pair. I feel like I'll be using the floral pattern sheet more. And then also from Target, I have my actual comforter. I just got a white one because I want to be able to decorate my dorm with like lots of color and stuff. And I feel like having white like essentials and stuff like that will make it a lot easier to use color, which is why I got a lot of white and gray things. Also in here, I kind of DIY vacuum sealed them, but there's a hole in the bag so that air started going back in anyways. Um, but I have two really squishy, really comfy pillows. These are from Marshalls. I love, like, squishable pillows, so these are my favorite thing ever. The final thing in this haul so far is my mattress topper. This is a cooling mattress topper. Um, I still need a mattress pad, but we have the topper. And with that, this haul is complete, and it looks like the dorm page of Target threw up in my bedroom. There is so much stuff around me right now. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys are also going into college, comment down below if you're excited, what you're ready for, what you're scared for, because I'm excited, but I'm also a little, little nervous. Um, this was the first, like, college video on my channel, which is crazy. So if you guys want to stick around with me, I like to vlog. I'm going to try and document college as much as I can. Um, I post book videos a lot if that's more your type of vibe. Um, and if not, thanks for sticking around with me. This video is so long and I just really want to get all of this out of my room. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye! Okay, but like, I am surrounded.